What's up everybody, Grand Hustler 32 here, I just want to make this quick video about Chrome for iOS. It's been out for a little bit now, but um still want to go over it with you because it's awesome that it is finally available for your iPhone or iPad or whatever. So it is free of course, you just got to go into the App Store and search for Chrome and it should be the top result. Download it and install it and there you go. So when you open it up, um, it will first ask you if you want to send information, blah, 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 you can accept it or not. And then you can enter in your uh, Google uh, account info and then you can have all of your bookmarks synced between your computer and your iPhone, which is very awesome. So if you just click on that, you have bookmarks. There is the mobile, which I don't have any. And then you can view all of your other bookmarks. Other devices you can see right here and go back to the most visited. Now of course, since I've been using it, that is a couple of websites that I've been to. Um, I'm not going to be able to do all of the uh, cool features that are available in here because either I don't know about them or they're just too many to offer and I just want to keep this video short. So you click up on that and this will bring you to the new tabs. Click on that for a new tab. You now have two. And uh, you can just click an X right there and then you can click on that one to go back. And let me add another tab. What's cool about this is you can just slide and that will switch in between tabs, which is really awesome. I, I love that feature. I just randomly found it one day and love that. So if you click on this, you can get a new tab, incognito tab, bookmarks, and other devices. Of course, this is just where you search and you can uh, search with voice, which is pretty awesome. Of course, this is different than Safari where the .com and stuff is up there um, instead of down there and whatnot. But uh, this is definitely opens a lot faster than Chrome and you don't have to do, or a lot faster than Safari and you don't have to deal with that stupid bookmarks page coming up and all that crap. Um, but yeah, this just works a lot better in every way than Safari. So yeah, check it out. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.